questions. Well, turning to sports, and in Israel, there are an increasing number of people doing what's called inline skating or rollerblading. Well, the first government recognized Wingate sponsored course has just finished that qualifies instructors in roller skating and online inline skating. Joining us now in the studio is Margot Ayun, who was in that course, and today you are the head of the freestyle slalom in Israel. Tell us about that. Um, well, slalom, freestyle slalom skating is a very um, a technical and artistic and fun discipline of uh, inline skating. And, um, and we in the Israel Roller Swans, which are slalom groups in Haifa, Tel Aviv, and the South, uh, really pushed for this course, and we, we managed well, to get it What is the sport? I mean, what are you doing when you inline skate? Um, well, there's all these different tricks of different levels. And, um, well, you're looking at some footage now. You can see this going through the cones. Right. So this is one of the most basic um, a, moves in slalom. And these are the course participants who are from all different disciplines of, um, of roller skating and inline skating. And so it was a challenge for them. A, here, this is in the Haifa group and uh, doing a lot of very cool stuff. Well, how popular and is this sport now in Israel? Is it growing? It's growing all the time. You know, there are, there's over 150,000 skates born, uh, bought in this country every year. And, um, it looks kind of dangerous. It's not dangerous. It's a sport. But if you have your safety gear mm -hmm. and you learn how to do it properly, then you're flying. And there's no feeling like it. Everyone is interested in skating. It's like everybody's little dream. They all talk about that. Mar Margaret, you're a pioneer in trying to get this recognized by the, uh, the Israel Sports Authority. How's that coming? Well, oh. are you trying to get more competitions? Well. We haven't been recognized until now. Now that we've finished this course, a, within the next month or two, that we're opening the, the freestyle slalom mm -hmm. branch in the Israel Roller Skating Association. And, uh, and then we can hold competitions and participate in competitions. We have to build up the slalom skaters uh, in Israel first before we get to that level. But like you say, we're, we're pioneers and it's happening and it's really exciting because it's so fun. And anyone can skate from of any age, How did any you get background. into this? Well, I'm 54 now. When I was 48, I was looking for something to do in August when there were no classes at the sports center. And I fell in love with it. And, um, and immediately started learning slalom from a friend. And, um, and I got hooked. You know, I understand that they're trying to make this one of the Olympic sports in the 2020 Olympics in Tokyo. What is it going to mean for the sport? Oh, well, the sky's the limit. You know, you get into the... It's one of eight candidates mm -hmm. uh, being considered for the 2020 Olympics. Um, then that's like arriving, you know, but we have a lot of work to do, and it's exciting because because we're doing the work. We're I mean, building it up Margot, in Israel. looking at these people going through the cones in, in, in these steps, it, it's almost like uh, an art, isn't it? Like ballet. It, it is. It's like figure skating, mm -hmm. but with a twist. But you don't need and an ice rink to do it. You can do it anywhere, right? Exactly. You just need the skates, some safety gear, and you, you know, some people go through the streets. We just need a little area where we can put 20 cones down, and, um, and we're in heaven. What are the yeah. countries where this is really popular? Uh, Singapore, mm -hmm. Russia, France, uh, Spain. It's growing all over, and it's a very new sport. It only started in the 90s. And we have it here and in so Israel. Well, Margo, we yeah, thanks for joining us on IBA News. Thank and tell you us so about much for having sport. me. And good luck. Thank you. Taking a look at the weather now, and there will be...